Hey everybody, it's Dave here from MogDog and welcome to the second video in our Max Farm series. In these videos, we'll have a look at different ways you can maximize the areas of your farm using various approaches and you can decide what works best for you. In today's video, we're going to be having a look at a sustainable design for your greenhouse that generates over $65,000 per week. If you enjoy this video, make sure you subscribe to our channel. We'll be doing plenty more just like it. Now for this build, we're going to need the following items. 18 of your favorite fruit tree sapling. If you don't yet have access to banana saplings from the island, then peach trees or pomegranates are your most profitable options. You will also need 6 iridium sprinklers and 116 seeds. I chose ancient fruit, but you could just as easily use any crop that continues to produce after the first harvest, like cranberries or blueberries for example. Just don't use a crop that grows on a trellis or you won't be able to maneuver around and collect them all. Now to optimize my sprinkler layout, I followed this pattern. Starting in the top right corner, use your hoe to dig two spaces to the left, move on over and stand on the next spot and dig one space down. Place your first sprinkler here in front of you, and once this is done, you can use your hoe as a handy way to show you where to place the remaining sprinklers, just like this. The last two sprinklers go on the edges in these spots. Alright, now that our watering system is in place, let's look at tree sapling placement. Leave one empty space to the left of the door and drop your first sapling down here. Between each tree, there needs to be two empty spaces, so the next one should be placed beside this pile of logs. After placing this one down, follow this pattern around the room. Once I placed the last one down on the top row, I found it easiest to go back down to the bottom and work my way back up again. Well, everything is all set up, all that's left to do is wait 28 days for everything to mature. And we're back! Our fully grown greenhouse looks fantastic! All that's left to do is collect this beautiful harvest and ship our goods. Let's see what we collect. So in total, we got 116 ancient fruit and a combination of 18 peach and pomegranate for a total sale of 64,925 bucks. Now that this greenhouse is all set up, it will continue to produce a similar harvest every week forever. Well, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, let us know in the comments section below and don't forget to smash that like button. It really helps us out. And we'll see you again soon for the next Max Farm video in this series. Bye for now.